Hi everyone! Good evening and thank you for joining us. My name is Jenny Dye and I am joining you from Thanksgiving Point in Lehigh, Utah. Uh, we are here at the premiere of a new film that comes out, I believe, Wednesday this week? Yes. Wednesday. It's Once I Was Engaged. It is the sequel to Once I Was a Beehive, which was released a few years ago. I'm sure you're all very familiar with it. And we've got joining us McLean Nelson and Claire... Do you want to can you come a little closer? <laughs> Thanks, it's okay. And Lisa Valentine Clark. So, welcome. Thank you for Thank you being for with us. Thank you for interviewing Yes, missionaries. Um, what would you guys like to like the audience to know about about this film? I would like to say that this is, if you ever saw Once I Was a Beehive, this is our sequel. As you can tell, this is Bree Carrington and her mom, <laughs> Carrie Carrington. Hello. They were everybody's favorite mother-daughter combo. <laughs> and in this movie, Bree gets engaged. And it's like... Mother of the bride, but better. And these two are so funny. The stress of planning a wedding, you know. The yeah. stress is joy. You have a very particular mom. <laughs> yeah, a uh, particularly effective and enthusiastic. <laughs> <laughs> Carrie Carrington won a little nuts uh, planning camp. Just think about how she plans her daughter's wedding. She gets crazy. <laughs> <laughs> effective. We'll call it effective. effective. Yeah. Effective. I mean, she, she gets it done. It's, yeah. She's not cheap. She's frugal. Yeah. That's <laughs> very important. It's a very important distinction. Yeah, but some of us can afford our own wedding dress. Well, let's, we'll see. <laughs> now, this is coming on the heels of, is it, well, on the heels of, it's been six years, right? Yes. Yeah. Since once I was a beehive? Yes, since the release. But so, in the movie world, the full six years hasn't passed. It's of like course. 18 months to two years that has passed. And Bree's at school at uh, BYU Hawaii. Ah, so. very good. Go Seasiders. 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 Yes. Correct. Yes. Of course, I knew that. That's right. I definitely yeah. knew. That. And she's kind of <laughs> contemplating: Do I do a mission? Do I keep my studies going? And then a certain young fellow comes into the picture. What's his Which name? Which always happens. Yeah. I mean, who among us has not been in that? Uh, so. <laughs> It's been six years since Once I Was a Beehive was released. How long has Once I Was Engaged been in the works? Is this something that when you wrote Beehive, you knew that there would be more? Or was it after that was released and you saw the success of it? Or how did that go? It was going to take a while. Okay, great. Uh, <laughs> after... 1995. <laughs> Imagine that. No, after, I, after the movie came out and people started really responding to it, Once I Was a Beehive... He would always ask, are you going to do a sequel? Are you going to do a sequel? And we were like, I, I don't know. We, we hadn't really thought about it. And then the more people asked, the more we saw, th started thinking about it. And then probably about 2017, we decided to really go hard and write a script. Yeah. And then just different things came up, that obstacles of, of different careers, different family situations, and we weren't able to do it until a global pandemic hit. And then... Then Suddenly we had no jobs. <laughs> yeah, and, and there was an opportunity to do something fun with your friends in a safe way, and we jumped on it. We thought, now is the time. Everything sort of aligned, and we had the best cheerleader in the world, Director McLean, who said, yeah, we can do this. And we were like, can we? But can we? And he just kept <laughs> pretending we could, and we just kept playing into that. Yeah. We and then one day them. we showed up on set and thought, Oh, okay, we're really doing this. I lured them in with Hawaii. I said, guys, <laughs> we're going to go eight days in Hawaii. We're going to, you know, you can't say no to that. So I'll say yeah. 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 So, and, and, and that's what part of this that I think is going to be really part of the legacy of the whole brand is you guys did this during a pandemic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, in 20 seconds, how did you do it? <laughs> Well, we, uh, we, we, we got a really great um, EMT that tested every day, mm -hmm. we, so we were super safe. We followed all the guidelines. We had to t get tested before we got to Hawaii. We did a bubble in Hawaii where we all just made sure that we didn't expose ourselves to any. We were just like a family living in one big house, mm -hmm. the Oahu Whale House, the best house in Hawaii. And we all wanted to do it so badly. We all just made a pact to each other that we wouldn't take any chances outside. So we just said, okay, will you guys all sacrifice and just stay in your homes and not, you know, risk anything? And we all wanted to do it so badly that we said, yeah, we will. We'll do it. That's yes. beautiful. I love that. I love I love that you were able to have success doing that during the pandemic. Uh, where will this be released? So this will be open uh, right away in 33 uh, uh, theaters in the state of Utah. Excellent. Starting tomorrow, actually, starting Tuesday uh, the 20th, Excellent. we have sneak peeks, and then and then it goes wide, and, and then on August 6th 
It's also available in, in theaters in Arizona, like the Phoenix, Arizona area, the Las Vegas, Nevada, and all over Idaho on August 6th. And then if it keeps doing well, it'll keep opening in other places. So tell your friends if they if they're if go to the website once I was engaged.com, if they don't see their theater there, write to their you know, call the local Cinemark Theater and say, Hey, we'd love this. Check back in, follow us on Instagram because we'll you know we'll be giving updates on where we're opening and go try to go see it this coming week it's pioneer pioneer day weekend here in utah it's hot outside go inside and enjoy yeah, the, the air conditioning and laugh with your friends and family you know it's been a long time since we could all get together and have a good time of all ages to get together and laugh and enjoy it so do it yeah and that's an excellent point which we talk about all the time with opening films that the success of it there may be some of you out there watching in areas where you're like well gosh i want to see this uh, is it coming to my area? What you need to do is go. Go to the theater this weekend. If it is not already scheduled at a theater in your area, uh, go to the website onceiwasengaged.com yes. and request it. Request it, and and that will determine the success of it. So Tell us on, write us a, a comment and, and, and say, we have this many people who would go see it. Let us know. Be, talk to us. We respond to everyone. Yeah. Everyone. Excellent. Yeah, so. Well, thank you guys so much. Uh, we've got this kind of uh, windy evening here, <laughs> um, yep. pre preview. So thank you guys for spending time with us. Awesome. Yeah, thank you. Go, you should go get a shot of the uh, of the poster over there, really quick. Oh so yeah. So everyone can see we'll it. Have to go over oh, there. We'll have. Yeah, we'll 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 Say goodbye to the ladies. All right. Hey, love you okay. Guys. So come on over here. Let's come on over here. I'll show you the uh, the poster. I'll explain it a little bit. And see what's wonderful about what we're doing right now is it's like an actual wedding reception. Okay, so here we have Claire, as you just met. This is Tanner Gilman. He was in Studio C. He is in Studio C, so you can see him in that. Of course, we have uh, Paris Warner, and, and we also have our, our Phoebe. She played Phoebe in the last one, Mila Smith. So there, Tinky's in the... Uh, Roxy, excuse me. And then we have Carrie Carrington now with her Giddy Planner Binder. You know, she had a Camp Binder before. Now she has a Planner Binder. So she's traded in the Camp Binder for a, a wedding binder and so anyways let's be honest all of us should be so lucky yes. to have Carrie Carrington yes, plan our absolutely. wedding absolutely <laughs> so awesome that's so we're so excited for yes. you playing can't wait for you to see it let's get a bunch of we'll get some some testimonials because I know we're gonna have some excited people after awesome. this so awesome. thank you alright thank you McLean over there. do you want to go say hi yeah yeah, can yeah. Do, that? do you have okay. time yes but will you uh, can I will you yes. guys just can, you bet yeah okay yeah, I'll, I'll all introduce right. it alright thank you so as you can see, yeah, this is the, the kind of pre-event before the the preview tonight of Once I Was Engaged, the sequel to Once I Was a Beehive, which came out six years ago. It's time for it's time for the new uh, the new episode, I guess, in this. Hello, hello. Hi. You are live to 112 world. people. 112? Yeah, for I, LDS. I can't think what to say. That's, yeah, you shouldn't have told many. me that. Yeah. <laughs> it's um, LDS missionaries. Well, That's I'm very excited to be here. Uh, so who, what do we want to talk about for these 112 people? I want to introduce Sean's character. Sean okay. plays the best man. It's a very amazingly fun cameo. Um, so we're super happy. We've been we've been performing together Improv. at the same comedy club for years, yeah. and then we were in show offs together on BYU TV, and we had to have him in this. And you're not going to want to miss his his part. There's and, a little, there's some improv elements to the yes. what's in the movie, so it's yes. fun. Yeah. Awesome so. outtakes too. Uh, there will be on the DVD. Oh, good. So, yes. Excellent. Yes. Look forward to that. So, I haven't seen it either. I'm excited. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. And he's hosting our, our after party tonight, which is fun. Ooh. Because he's the best man host, so we're having the reception theme carry on. Yeah. So. Oh. Anyway. Awesome. Well, awesome. What was... Awesome. Yeah. Um, so, gosh, I don't know. I, there's so much to say about this film. Um, are you a fan of Once I Was a Beehive? Oh, of yeah. Of course you are. All these guys have been my friends for the longest time, but when they made Once I Was a Beehive, I was just a college kid. Now I've come of age, and I'm able to, you know, hold my own in the in the talented circles of these guys. Yeah. So they're and hilarious. It, and if I you haven't it. yet checked out Sean's uh, Instagram, at Johnson Files, oh my goodness. it is the funniest thing that you will follow. <laughs> Absolutely. We're getting a lot of emojis. Yes. yes. Amen. All right. Yes. Yeah. All right. Yes. Yes. So you know Sean. So. Awesome. Well, go yeah. see the movie for sure. Yeah. I mean, I'm just excited to have my little moment in it. And yeah, the, what they pulled off during COVID, you probably talked about it. Yep. Not a lot of people were doing any movies at all 
you know, let alone just like bootstrapping it the way McLean was. So it's pretty cool. Yeah, and, yeah exactly. Uh, doing that during COVID, uh, anything production wise, anything is such a monster to pull off. And yeah. to do it with the COVID restrictions on top of that is just it. It's unbelievable. It's awesome it's that, it, actually that unbelievable. it worked out and that they finished it. So yeah, it super cool. so impressive. So I mean, you heard it from Sean. Please go see it. Like we said. Uh, the best way to ensure the success of this film in the theaters is to go see it in person this weekend. Go to onceiwasengaged.com, look for where it is showing. If you find that it isn't scheduled to be shown in your area, go ahead and request it. Uh, leave a comment on their Instagram. They're quite uh, responsive to all the comments. And uh, yeah, thank awesome. you guys so Thanks, much Sean, for your guys. time. Really appreciate Excited it. To see the movie. Yeah, yes. awesome. Can't wait. Okay, so is that all we've got? Yeah, let's yep. log okay, great. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, again, I'm Jenny Dye, and please go see Once I Was Engaged. We'll talk again soon. Bye-bye.